So please tell me about your experience of the Zanskar trip. So I thought it was a wonderful experience. Uh, the place is just amazing. The organization was absolutely amazing. And um, I think we felt, although the terrain is rough, I think we felt we were in very safe hands at all points in time. So all in all, I thought it, it was a wonderful trip from our perspective. What would you suggest to someone coming to Zanskar? What would I suggest? Well, a couple of things, I guess. One is, you know, be prepared for how different it is, uh, both from a, the standpoint of what you see, as well as connectivity, the roads, uh, everything is very different from what one experiences anywhere else. So uh, I'd say, you know, bear in mind, uh, keep that in mind for sure when you plan. And I think be realistic about your own skill and experience level. Uh, videos don't tell you everything. We, you know, we thought we be prepared, but uh, videos tend to sort of give you a romantic picture of how exciting it will be. And yes, of course, it's very exciting, and that's a great part of it. But it can be a little frightening sometimes. So, uh, just be prepared for that. It, it can sort of hit you from left field. So, um, if, if this is what you know, if the thrill part is what you're looking for, then yes, of course. Uh, but just, yeah, that's my take on it. <laughs> After the trip. whole trip, what was the best moment which you will remember? Oh, there's so many of them. I, I really <laughs> can't pick one, but. Every one of the places that we stayed, I think, you know, the Aryan, starting with the Aryan village, I was most, well, I can pick one. I was most worried about the camp at Pune, to be honest, but that turned out to be the best part of the journey for me. Uh, I, I just, I just thought it was brilliant, absolutely brilliant. I mean, uh, it's been a while since I've you know, lived roughed in a, out, yeah, roughed right? it out, uh, and I, I was a bit apprehensive, mm -hmm. but... To me, that was those were the best two days of the trip. Honestly, the best part for me was uh, waking up at three and uh, in absolute darkness and seeing that sky full of stars. And I that that just uh, that will stay with me for a very long time. And it makes it completely worth it. Makes everything completely worth it. And of course, uh, the overall the experience was very what I said. They felt in very good hands. I didn't feel unsafe at any point in time. How was the experience with the company? Stunning. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Everything planned to a T. I think a uh, very approachable set of people. Um, I don't think there was a single thing that we suggested that was not taken on board or um, any feedback we provided that was not acted upon. I, I can't think of anything. I think it was all brilliant, absolutely brilliant. The feeling I came, not just came away with, I, I experienced it throughout was this is a team and a company with integrity. Um, it, it just felt very, uh, what, what did you say yesterday? This is a clean stretch. Sure. <laughs> no bullshit. <laughs> this, this is what no bullshit gets you, you know. It gets you the heart of the thing and uh, Really, I think we experienced the heart of, of Ladakh and Zanskar thanks to Dream Riders. Thanks to the company and th most of all thanks to the, the yeah, team Thanks on the to ground. the operating team on the ground. The operating Absolutely. team on the ground. There was, yeah, there was some perhaps uh, I don't know, misconceptions that we, or I don't know, gaps in information that we came with, but uh, that was more than made up for. So when, I, when are we seeing you next? Very soon. Very, very, <laughs> very soon. <laughs> soon. <laughs> In fact, we were discussing with a few possible trips with Dave this evening. <laughs> so, very soon. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much.